Hello, my kindred spirits. Welcome to Fairyling Cottage. This is part one of a two-part series where I just paint stuff to put in some frames I found at Goodwill. The smaller rose frame that looks kind of like a mixture of light academia and cottage core can only fit something that is cut into an oval shape, and I don't have anything that's oval right now. The larger frame that is very cottage core needs a horizontal picture, which I also don't have. So, I'm going to paint my own pictures to put in these frames. I recently got a travel watercolor kit to bring to college, as well as to go with my mini watercolor booklet that I made in a previous video, and I wanted to use it today to test it out. paint something for the horizontal cottage core frame first. I'm using references for this, but I just searched up images online until I found one that I liked to draw inspiration from. I think the image I found comes from some sort of anime, but it was so tranquil looking and cottage core that I had to choose it. I used the reference picture as inspiration and made some changes here and there to make it a bit more personal. The watercolor kit comes with a brush that you can fill with water, and when you squeeze it, the water flows into the bristles, which is very neat. The paints themselves were really nice as well. And I'd give this travel kit a high rating as it is so convenient and also high quality. Obviously, this video is not sponsored, but I'll still put the link to the kit if you're curious and want to check it out. But for now, let's get back to the painting. I layered many colors to get the effect I wanted, and overall, it was a very relaxing and fun experience. I will definitely be painting like this more.
me being me, I went in with a fine liner to outline some of the more prominent areas of the painting, such as the little girl, the rocks, and some blades of grass in the foreground. Here's the finished painting. It's not super detailed, but I still like how it came out. Now let's see what it looks like in the frame. I think it really matches the frame's style, and I'm looking forward to putting this up as decor in my room. That's all for now. Thank you for joining friends, and I'll see you in the next video.